and heightened security under the Friday night lights. This radically charged picture taken by Escondido High seniors provoking a threat against tonight's game. 10 News reporter Anthony Pura was there as many turned out despite this warning from police. Anthony. Police had extra patrols at this game tonight and even before kickoff they were urging people to say something if they saw anything suspicious. Parents say it was concerning but not enough to keep them away from the game. Friday night home games typically draw a crowd. The kids are riled up and getting pumped and ready for the game. The game tonight, Escondido High School against Rancho Buena Vista. My friend told me that, are you going to the game? And I was like, like why? And she's like, oh, because of the threat at Escondido. And I was like, what are you talking about? Police say there was a threat made over social media. The threat was in response to this now infamous picture shared over and over again. A group of Escondido High seniors posed, spelled out the N-word with their shirts. I'm not, I'm not even sure what kind of threat it is. I'm not going to keep a let a threat keep me from watching my son's uh, football game. I think it's just kids overreacting. In a statement, the school district told 10 News they talked with police and was told the level of threat did not warrant canceling the game. Kids will be silly kids and People making threats are probably just being silly kids back. Let's get ready and make some noise. By the time the players took the field, Escondido. fans took their seats. But people told us the stands didn't fill up like they normally do, but they couldn't say if the threat had anything to do with it. I think this thing has gotten way out of hand. And the school district tells us that students in the picture will face consequences, but not criminal charges. In Escondido, Anthony Pura, 10 News.